thing though you know that would that would be a good look at that's a career killer right there but at the same time well here's me here's my whole question for me i think in in this case i think will was still in a right why man why why because number one look at it this way i i said i a part of me thinks that will is in the right but they're still wrong in this too so here's my deal will's in the right because one there was an incident that goes back to 2016 when uh, Jada wasn't accepted into the Oscars or anything like that. She had like a little boycott and everything like that. And, you know, Chris ranked on her then. And then also was ranking on Will with some, I don't remember. But in this case, about a year or two ago, probably even longer, uh, Jada mentioned that she has alopecia and that she's been suffering through that. So it's not like you couldn't have found out uh, what was going on because see when you're a comedian you have to know of what's going on basically in the real world what's happening up to date and everything like that because that's how you get your stick that's how you get your the meat of your comedy so did he not know about that no i don't believe i believe he did knew and he's like you know what i, I might as well go for it because she hasn't been here in four years or whatever so i might as well take my shot especially now since will is going to probably get an oscar now on the opposite side is Jada in the wrong of this? Yes, I do say that. Because of everything that's been happening since the the, the red table talk, uh, the entanglement, all that stuff, it, it just kind of made Will look, you know, bad. It made him look bad. And uh, But a lot of people are going at Will right now because saying, obviously, he shouldn't have done that. It was unprofessional and everything like that. But at the same time, they're all saying, well, when where was this uh, ruthlessness or aggression when uh, when uh, Jada, quote unquote, was getting her back blown out by that dude, so it takes two to tango. So that's that's my stick on that. I agree with you, man. It just I when you go to the Oscars, it's open season. It's open season on everybody and everything, man. When you go to the Oscars, that's what you expect, man. That's why they pay the comedians to do what they do, man. Because if they didn't talk about people, but we watch it. Mm-hmm. Let's be honest. He knew, you know, he should have just been professional about it and say, look, man, talk with him. He Will still went and spoke with him after the show and said, look, I didn't like that too much. I'm telling you man to man. But to get up there and bitch slap me like that, and then, you know, Chris had me cracking up. He was like, Will Smith just bitch slapped me. Literally, he smacked the shit out of me. I'm like, damn. <laughs> uh-huh. just, to me, it just made, honestly, that made nothing to me. It just made them look like they were asking to begin with, man. Because I'm looking, I'm like, I'm like, if you gonna get like that, it was a statement that that what the white chick made, man. It was a statement 
that she made. Who? Schumer. Schumer. Oh, Amy Schumer. Yeah, man. And, you know, it was lighthearted, man. It was lighthearted. She sat up front. She was like, well, she was like, you know, you, um, I'm the type of person. She says a statement about calling the cops up on black folk. I laughed at it. I thought it wasn't offensive. Mm-hmm. You know, blah, blah, blah. What she, what he said about Jada, I didn't think it was offensive at all, man. I mean, he didn't call her. Now, if he would have called her a bald-headed bitch, yeah. Okay. But he, he didn't call a bald-headed bitch. He just said, you look at it, are you auditioning for G.I. Jane 2? That's all he said. Mm-hmm. He didn't say anything that was, I gotta say, I, to me, I didn't think it was offensive what he said. I think what he, he would have called her a bitch, yeah, he had the right, but he didn't go that deep. Mm-hmm. So, all right, all right, GPS, now you. Okay. Let's say Chris Rock was not Chris Rock. Let's say he was The Rock. Mm. Would you have thought to even try it? Oh, if there was no. Jamie Fox over there, would you have thought to even try it? Probably, yeah. <laughs> yeah, probably, yeah. <laughs> just, just ask Uncle L. Ask Uncle L. <laughs> um, hey. If that was any one of the Wayans brothers, would you have thought to try it? Yeah. Nah, it except my except ass. maybe except maybe Keenan. Probably not Keenan, but everybody else here. I don't know. They would jump my ass, bro. Wow, I would. Sean, man, they got some height on them now. Well, they got the but they they they, they go face to face. But you know, you know, it's all about scrapping. They just scrap, man. The Wayne brothers just scrap. Don't be fooled by you grow up with the brothers. You you gonna know how to scrap. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. But uh, I think it was slightly opportunistic. I don't even know if I can really believe all of it was that real. Mm-hmm. Because let's, I mean, let's just think. I mean, how many Oscars has he uh, presented at or been around and somebody got roasted or somebody and their wife got roasted? You didn't get nearly as upset and more did the person that was getting roasted. It is what it is. They invite you out, they roast you, they give you an award, everybody goes home. Mm-hmm. Now all of a sudden the rules change because it's Jada? No. Hey, you, you get paid. You get paid to be there. <laughs> and you get paid. So now you need to tell me because somebody said because somebody said something you didn't like, you was going to give up X amount of dollars mm-hmm. plus the award now you got this thing hanging over your head. Nobody's going to want to work with you now. Because, you know, if, any, if, you, if we all think that somebody said something about your wife, you got to see you doing this. I'm sorry. Just just if that was handled entirely incorrectly. Okay, it's not like you was walking down the street and somebody smacked you on the ass. Um, no. You should have just pulled him to the side like Torsen said. Like uh, Fitz, you said earlier, hey, look. Blah, 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 blah. Look, I'm still hearing it from the last one. Look. Do me a favor. If any jokes that come up about it, just don't. Uh-huh. Just don't even do it. Because I got to hear it and do it. Come on. It's not that serious. And bang, it'll have been gone. Oh, hell, you could have got a, new, a message up to him somehow, some way. Somebody sent him something. All right, look, leave Jada Lunk. She ain't liking it. Whatever. Well, I mean, she showed her reaction right there. She rolled her eyes and everything. So she really wasn't really into that. Because remember, she came out with that announcement. Live, I don't know if it was on her red uh, red table or it was Instagram or whatever that she mentioned that she had this condition, and it's a legit condition. I mean, I know a few people that have that. 